So gird up your loins and eat up your lambs We're leaving the city, we're leaving no man We're walking through water like splitting the sea This is the vision that our fathers were deemed Men of Elohim, led by Moshe We cried with one voice and he heard us pray He led us in the wilderness and gave us man about what did we do? We worshiped another Shalom wise beings For those that don't know, I go by Kokmaya Welcome to my channel. Thank you so much for subscribing and tuning in. So today is Yom Shalishi. I post about anything, or at least I make videos about anything concerning work on Yom Shani, which is Monday. And I hope you guys enjoy this information. Today we are going to discuss three ventures on how I stay at home. Two of those ventures I am actually trying out for the first time. So just a quick disclaimer, most of the videos at this time that I'm going to be posting is either going to be videos that I have or things that I have tried and, or things that I'm about to try. And I'm going to let you know whichever one it is. You want to make sure that you're watching out for scams and everything. So if you guys want to wait on whatever I'm posting, just wait. I'll do a follow up and then you guys can go from there if you are extra, extra, extra cautious. But either way, I'm trying these things out because my main mission is to stay at home and have as many sources of income as I can. So I am very successful on eBay with my selling um, and then as well as with Amazon and the affiliate links and the blogs that I talked about last time. I had that link below in my description. So for this time, again, three new job leads. So the first one is one that I am very successful in and I really like because I like taking care of children. It is called SitterCity.com. I'm able to sign up on the website. I'm able to do a quick background check. You don't have to do the background check, but with the background check, it allows parents to feel more safe. Once you do your background check, you'll go on the top corner over here. You'll enter into your information, everything that you need, and then you'll go ahead and you'll log in from there. Once you log in, you find the ad address or the zip code that you have. Once you post in a zip code, then you will fill out that information where parents is are where parents are looking for care for their children or for their yellow them and then you will send in your application once you send in your application here's a little message that i had between somebody they'll tell you whether they want the job maybe they won't contact you if they don't nine chance out of ten and then um with this case it led to me having a job and i was able to take care of a cute little baby from there so that is one quick little job it was it was a great job and a great opportunity you have the potential to make um as much as as you like up here it just depends some clients i so i saw this one post it was two hours out of the day for ten dollars which is twenty dollars a day for five days that's a hundred dollars and then i saw this other post it was later on that that night and basically it was a couple of hours it was like ten dollars to fifteen dollars per hour and then that would be also for the rest of the week so you're able to grab that income and you're able to also take care of your family with that one um, so not only do they have babysitting nanny pet care companion and housekeeping there's also ways to keep a track of your availability as well as how they pay you uh, what they expect on so with that being said things that help you to get promoted of course if you're paying it's a $15 fee for about a month you pay for that and you can renew it every month if you like if you haven't received the job that you desire or you can keep it and basically it promotes your page it puts you on the top and it helps a lot of people to see your page it helps it gives you like gold badges gold stars so that way um parents will also like that you know a lot of people uh, will gravitate towards that because you'll show up first. So that's one job. The next job is called Fiverr. If you guys have ever seen the Watchmen films, they use Jesus. So if you guys remember that, he was the one that played White Jesus. And basically, um, he was able to post, I'll say anything that you want. 
you pay me whatever amount of money it is and that's how they were able to get that video he allowed them to do you know have all full creative control over that clip or whatever that he provided and they were able to use that in his film i always thought you know how did they get somebody to say that you know i was like man he must be down must be down for the cause but you know that's that's how he was they were able to do that which was a great film so the next thing is once you sign up for Fiverr, you'll first want to sign up for a, a, a buyer account. Once you do the buyer account, the buyer account is on the app, and then the seller account you have to do on the desktop. So uh, here's a couple of steps that I have right here. First, you'll give your information. So you'll after you give your information, you'll sign up for the gigs. After you do the gigs, you'll sign up for uh, a set setting your plan after you set your plan you're also going to write a description of what what you're what you're selling you're going to have a gallery and then you're going to basically await to be approved and once you await to be approved then you'll be able to uh, go from there it, it so far I just signed up for that I put my drawings I put certain things up there I made a clip a quick little video and they also have sites on their site to help you learn how to sell more um, so this is my first time so if you guys want to visit my Fiverr uh, later on when um, the account actually gets to post my post gigs then I do commission artwork um, a lot of times I'm doing drawings for the yellow dim and you know any type of things that you guys see here so that would be really cool so that is fiber so then the last one is another one that I am awaiting on I sent in my resume it is a book review site and the book review site is called the website is called kirkusreviews.com so with this book review site I sent in my resume and um, from what I read about it is looking for professional readers. They're going to give you a book. After you read the book, you'll turn in that information within a certain amount of time and you're just reviewing the book. They want your honest opinion on it. So once you're able to give that information, you want to make sure that your resume is catered to what they may need. So for instance, I put on my resume detailed things that I was doing as a reviewer, like me doing mystery shopping is something I take very serious me talking about any herbal treatments that I may have used and or even reasons why I'm not using any of the unnatural products and why I'm using natural ones so I'm reviewing products so I do have a background in that and you just provide any of your media accounts and then you can go from there so I hope you guys enjoyed this video uh, please share this video if you guys desire to and thank you for watching Shalom Shalom. Okay. I love the babies. Okay. Do you remember the time? <laughs> Shalom. Shalom, Yisrael. I just want to hear a Shabbat joke. Okay, so. I'll be giving you guys all the information 24 6. Ah, cut that out. Okay. So, again, three new job plans. That's new job plans.